I think ever since I can remember, I've uh, been interested in running around or playing anything that I can get my hands on. And by the age of 15, I uh, played my first uh, national level tournaments in both football and basketball. Wearing Pakistan's flag on my jersey. I think there's a greater responsibility on your shoulders to project a positive image of your country. And it's really a good feeling to know that in whatever way, big or small, you've done something for your country. You know, when you're younger, nobody realizes, you know, you're just a bunch of little kids, boys and girls, everybody's playing together. But eventually, I think the girls grow up. In my school, while there were a lot of girls when we started out, by the end of it, I was the only one standing with a ball on the court in my hand. I've come across a few individuals who've discouraged me from playing sports simply because I think they'd want me to exhibit more ladylike behavior because somehow playing sports is not ladylike. I myself find that I'm stared at when I'm working out and a younger girl who may be more conscious of herself or may have taken her first steps into this field uh, may even be more concerned or vulnerable. It's a common perception that there's a lack of funds or resources in sports. However, I find that when the concerned authorities do have resources, they spend them on the male's team rather than the female teams. But having gone through all of that, I think I've come out a more stronger person, taught me how to take initiative in life, how to be more persistent, and uh, made me want to make my place in this field of sports and I don't see anything wrong with what I'm doing. While I've always enjoyed playing sports, I am a strong proponent of gaining an education, uh, which is why I wanted to combine my passion with my academics, which led me to pursue a master's in international development from Ohio University on the Fulbright Scholarship. I specialized in sport, gender, and development uh, with a certificate in women's studies. Through my degree program, I had the chance to go to Ecuador, South America, where I implemented my sports and development project with underprivileged children. Since the time I've returned to Pakistan, I've become captain of the Pakistan national women's basketball team. I'm also playing football with my club, the Young Rising Stars, and uh, coach their junior team. As captain of the Pakistan national women's basketball team, I feel it's my responsibility to scout for up-and-coming talent and guide them in the right direction. Besides that, I like to engage myself in voluntary and uh, community activities that revolve around sport and youth development because that's something close to my heart. Sport has a beauty to it and it can add so much value to your life like it has done to mine. It's taught me how to manage my time better, it's taught me how to interact with other people and really respect others and respect yourself uh, when you're involved in such an activity. I think I'd want to spend most of my time uh, promoting it even after I'm done playing, uh, whether it's in my community, whether it's on a national level. Everything that I've learned, all the memories that I have, all the friends that I've made, all because I somehow, luckily, managed to end up in sport. Sports are of jeetna, harne, iska naam nahi hai. For me, it's about breaking barriers. It's about bringing worlds together. If you are looking to do something good for our community, it would be nice to invest in sports programs, especially for girls, since you know we have a lot of talent. My name is Sana Mahmood, and I want to help create role models for Pakistani women in sport.